how to score 60 plus marks in analog and digital electronics eighteen CS thirty three. So we'll write down all the five modules first. Photodiode LED Optocouplers and BJD biasing bipolar junction transistor biasing second one is K map third one is combinational circuit design and stimulation using gates using logic gates <coughs> fourth one is introduction to VHDL Fifth one is Registers and Counters or Each module contains 20-20 marks So altogether 100 marks As there are 5 modules 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 So go on with 2nd module KMAP Then go on with fourth module second module fourth module in this only study flip-flop and latches then go to first module in this first module it's a bit tough but it's easy to study and then go to third module in this we'll have uh, 8 is to 1 marks, 4 is to 1 marks, 16 is to 1 marks, D marks and PLA, PL everything, third module and then go to fifth module, resistors and latches if you study flip flop and latches then resistors and counters will be very much easy for you so now we'll uh, start with second module that is uh, KMAP in KMAP you have to study um, K map uh, mapping you have to know everything K map mapping rules and everything in K map first you have to study SOP and POS second you have to study QM method Quinn's McLinsky method in K map only this two you should study will get plus 15 marks in second module first question is if of A, B, C, D is equal to summation of M 1, 3, 4, 5, 7, 10, 12 this is SOP if they don't ask specify SOP or POS in question you have to go on with SOP this is sum of products F of A, B, C, D summation of m 5 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 and 15 this is SOP problem second one is Queen McClensky problem key method problem Solve prime implicants. You have to write the prime implicants, and they'll ask what is prime implicant. Your of A, B, C, D is equal to summation of M 0, 2, 3, 4, 8, 
टेन ट्वेल्व थर्टीन फोर्टीन विल गो ऑन विथ फोर्थ मॉड्यूल दैट इज इंट्रोडक्शन टू वी एस डी एल एंड लैच एस एंड फ्लिप फ्लॉप इन लैच एस एंड यू हैव टू स्टडी इन फोर्थ मॉड्यूल ओनली लैच एस एंड फ्लिप फॉल फ्लिप फ्लॉप्स एंड द फर्स्ट थिंग यू विल स्टडी इज एक्सप्लेन द फॉलोइंग D flip flop, RS flip flop, JK flip flop, T flip flop, Masters slave. जेके फ्लिप फ्लॉप टू स्टडी ऑल दिस इजीली व्हाट यू हैव टू डू यू हैव टू ट्रूथ टेबल यू हैव टू नो द ट्रूथ टेबल फर्स्ट यू हैव टू राइट डी फ्लिप फ्लॉप द ट्रूथ टेबल ऑफ डी फ्लिप फ्लॉप आर एस फ्लिप फ्लॉप ट्रूथ टेबल जेके फ्लिप फ्लॉप ट्रूथ टेबल टी फ्लिप फ्लॉप ट्रूथ टेबल मास्टर स्लेव जेके फ्लिप फ्लॉप ट्रूथ टेबल If you compare all the truth tables, you will understand what is the difference between them. Everything is similar and everything is easy. Just focus on truth table and just uh, see the circuit diagrams of each flip flop. What the what does they do? What will they do? You have to study also characteristics of all these flip flop. Of all these flip flop. We will go on with first module, that is VJT biasing LED and um, everything. That first module you can see. Rewind the video and see. Okay. Now in first module, what you have to study? Uh, LED uh, principle of LED. LED principle, working principle, second um, photodiode. डायग्राम वर्किंग प्रिंसिपल ऑप्टो कपलर्स एंड वर्किंग प्रिंसिपल एनी वन अमाउंट थ्री डेफिनेटली फॉर फाइव प्लस मार्क्स इट विल बी एट और सेवन एनी थिंग फाइव प्लस मार्क्स दिस थ्री फोर्थ वन इज विद डायग्राम एक्सप्लेन फॉर्मेशन ऑफ डिप्लीशन लेयर डिप्लीशन लेयर explain vi characteristics of pn pn junction dot what is transistor and what is the need of biasing and different types of biasing seventh one with need diagram explain voltage divider bias with equations mm, right 
write the ideal and practical characteristics of opam with neat diagram explain mono stable multi vibrator using ic 355 same as with neat diagram explain a stable multi vibrator using ic 355 11th one explain the following ye peak detector b smith trigger trigger circuit active filters low pass filter high pass filters voltage regulator you can get anything from this you have to study all this thing 12th month with neat diagram explain analog to digital converter ye r to r ladder b1 binary weighted weighted adc adc numerical from first module for the circuit diagram for the circuit shown draw dc load line use silicon transistor with b is equal to 50 vve is equal to 0.7 volts RC is equal to 2.2 kilo ohms. RB is equal to 240 kilo ohms. Plus uh, plus VCC is equal to 12 volts. For the circuit diagram, 13th month. module uh, module 3 you have to study what are hazards let's and how to eliminate hazards second one what oh, importance of tri state buffer tri state buffer third one is um, Um, max and D max. Two is to one 
max 4 is to 1 max 8 is to 1 max 16 is to 1 max they will ask construct 16 is to 1 max using 2 is to 1 max 4 is to 1 max you have to study everything max and dmax this are important thing and module 3 it is big you have if uh, this is important concentrate on these three we want to score good uh, study everything now module 5 registers and counters counters in registers what is register what is counter and uh, have to study serial in serial out serial in parallel out parallel in serial out parallel in parallel out registers and you have to study um, parallel ladder with accumulator with neat diagram explain working principle of n bit parallel ladder with accumulator designer counter using given state diagram <coughs> You can use any flip flop to design a counter. Zero 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 one zero zero one 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 zero one zero zero one one straight diagram. You can specify, or if they don't specify, you can go on with D or T flip flop. All they will specifically ask JK flip flop. Yes, this is the important questions in ADE 18 CS 33. For good, for more marks, we have to study all the whole syllabus. Thank you.